On 1st of November, some 20 years ago, an infant with undecidedly grey-green eyes bowled its way into the world, thrilling two young parents with each lusty year. Even as she grew, the thrill continued, reaching out now to her growing world of friends and strangers. At 21, she's done it again. With a brilliant flash of eyes and a hint of a smile, she's thrilled the world. And who is she, ladies and gentlemen? Aishwarya's tryst with fame began here in Goa, amidst the backdrop of the sea, the sand and the surf. She claimed her place in the sun. Her incredible knack for hat-tricks first showed up at the Femina Miss India contest when she walked away with the three most coveted prizes, Miss Catwalk, Miss Ten and Miss Photogenic. had one more prize to claim, had she talked her way to it. Einstein, Shakespeare and Mahatma Gandhi, whose contribution to the world do you think was the most important and why? Einstein, Shakespeare, Mahatma Gandhi. Mahatma Gandhi, to be very honest, because he taught us the spirit of non-violence, which is essential, which was essential yesterday, today and tomorrow. Thank you. Pageants today have changed their perception of beauty, almost redefining the phrase vital statistics to include the intellect a contestant may possess. The ability to think on your feet is as important as the ability to walk with them. For Aishwarya, it was a cakewalk. If you could miraculously change the course of one important historic event, which one will it be and why? The historic event I'd have changed the course of, my birth. Because I wish I were born earlier, so that I know that I would have been a leader of sorts and have definitely prevented the wars of this world. Thank you. All that stood between her and her halo of glory was a brief but interminable moment. And finally, the wait was over. She had invested herself and she had been rewarded. Miss India, two title is Miss Aishwarya Rai. Namaste, I'm Aishwarya Rai, 21 years old, and come from the country of love, peace, and harmony, India. And Miss World 1994 is Miss India. Homecoming of Aishwarya Rai, Miss World 1994, finally happened on the 16th of December. 
Waiting eagerly for her at the airport were her proud parents, a beaming Mr. Pradeep Puha, director, Times of India Publications, Femna editor Satya Saran, and ace designer Hemant Trivedi. Our press world clamored to get a picture of her. We're here at the press conference held at the Taj Mahal Hotel, Bombay, where Miss Eshwarya Rai shall be meeting the press for the first time after her crowning.
On her last leg of a hectic homecoming schedule, Aishwarya Rai, Miss World 1994, paid a visit to the Shraddhanand Ashram, an orphanage for abandoned and homeless girls in suburban Bombay. Kids. She spent time speaking with committee members from the ashram about the lives of the girls in the orphanage. Mm -hmm. Moving on further, she spent time with the tiny toddlers at the ashram where her spontaneous rapport with the babies was a delightful sight for the onlookers. The children of the ashram presented a moving program displaying their talents in diverse activities, proving unmistakably that though they were orphans, they were not without well-rounded personalities and unique talents and gifts of their own, which, if nurtured in the right environment, would flower and blossom in their own right. In her own words, there was admiration for their strength and encouragement for their endeavors. <laughs> 